Hi, welcome to JLabs. Today I'm going to show you the steps on how to run a Raspberry Pi on a laptop. These are the things that you need. Putty, USB to TTL serial cable, Ethernet cable or Wi-Fi dongle, and VNC. In this video, we will cover the steps that will connect our Pi to the laptop via SSH. And by the end of this video, our Pi can be accessed on our laptop via console using the Putty application. First, prepare the USB to TTL serial cable and install the necessary drivers on your laptop. Forgetting to install this driver will result to unexpected behavior when you try to reconnect to your Pi. Please refer to your cable's manual. Connect the four pins of your cable to its counterpart pins on your Raspberry Pi. 5-volt pin of the cable goes to the 5-volt pin of the Pi. Ground pin of the cable goes to the ground pin of the Pi. Rx pin of the cable goes to the Tx pin of the Pi. And Tx pin of the cable goes to the Rx pin of the Pi. Connect the USB of the USB to TTL serial cable to your laptop. The Raspberry Pi will now boot. Wait for at least one minute to complete its startup. While waiting for the Pi to complete its boot sequence, Open your computer's device manager and find out what comfort your cable has been assigned, and take note of it. Open Putty, select Serial from the connection type, enter the assigned comfort of your serial cable in the serial line, and input 115.200 to the speed. Click the Open button below. A console will launch. If you see this screen, just press Enter and the following text to load. Enter Pi for username and Raspberry for password. Congratulations! You are now successfully logged into your Raspberry Pi and can now begin using the device. However, if you want to use a graphical user interface for your Pi, then you might want to check out the next steps on our next video. Please don't forget to hit the subscribe button below.